I'm back! I was gonna take the time to actually like get ready and put makeup on and stuff for this video, but I was just too excited. So I still have not technically jumped on the loot crate bandwagon. But when I saw what the theme for September's box was, and I saw Firefly, there was no saying no to this. So I got one loot crate. Maybe in the future I'll keep doing it. But for now, just this one, the galactic one. <whistles> Totoro, she's excited too. Also a little freaked out because it's a big black box and she's scared of everything. This literally just arrived here a minute ago. And I stood there at the door and waited. Because I want to see what's in it. Hey, they don't have the little thing on top to show you what's inside. But I see stuff already and I'm trying not to look at it. Okay. Let's pull this little guy. Ooh. <gasps> Pop Rocks! Actually, I had a love-hate relationship with these when I was a kid. Because they taste good. You're ruining this video. They taste good, but uh, I didn't like the popping sensation. What are you doing? You don't... Oh, she doesn't like the Pop Rocks. Okay, denied. No Pop Rocks for Totoro. <laughs> Let's see what this little guy is. Oh, this is kind of fun. They decorated the box again, because I've watched a few people's Loot Crate boxes. Unboxing videos. But they kind of decorated it a little bit. Ooh, you just got a sneak peek. Okay, let's see what this guy is. Oh yeah, they said there was an alien thing, but I... Never seen Alien. Probably never will because it's R-rated and I don't watch R-rated movies, but, uh... So... Ash. Action figure from Alien. He's just a dude. I'll, uh, use him as a dude in some videos. Okay, I want to do these last because I'm trying not to kind of... Honey, she's really ruining this video. Hopefully she'll quiet down over there. Wee! Wee! Oh, now she's happy. Wee! Wee! The Loot Crate Galactic Button. Focus on it. It's got Darth Vader there on it. Yeah. So now I have a button. I don't have any Loot Crate buttons because this is the one and only Loot Crate I've ever gotten. Let's see what's down here. It seems that there is a poster. Likely. Oh, this is a magnet. Okay. Oh, it's that, um... <laughs> it's like Space Invaders or whatever that game is, only it's, um, Star Wars themed. <laughs> That's awesome. I like that. A code for Halo, which I don't play. So maybe I'll give that away. Or maybe I'll give it to my brother. What's this? Oh, this is... Oh my gosh! That is so awesome! It's the money from Fire... The battery just died right as I was trying to show you the money. Anyway, it's the money from Firefly. Let me just... Look at that! That is so awesome. I I love fake money. <laughs> okay, so this is the thing that shows pictures of last crate. <laughs> Brown coat's guide to Oh look at Death Star Maze. Sorry, I keep putting it forward and then I have to focus. We'll just put it back here. That's awesome. I just watched uh, Megan's um, Maze Runner video, so it's funny they have a maze in there. Mega crate! I wish I could get a mega crate, even though I only bought one crate. But I, this is like the one crate that I really wanted. So if I want to make a crate, I'd be super happy. Just because I love Firefly. What's this? Do, do, do. Oh, savings for some stuff. Oh, coupons. Gotta love coupons. Okay, this appears to be a poster. Yes! This is going on the side of my desk. That is awesome. 
Oh my gosh. That is awesome. <laughs> that is the best. This crate is awesome. I am such a nerd. Okay, I don't know which one of these to do first. We got a science fiction vinyl figure. And then this guy. Let's do the science fiction vinyl figure because I already know what this guy is. It's so cute. Apparently, you need scissors. Because I can't rip plastic. Yeah, you want to see what um, is in my vinyl figure box? Wait, how does it open? Do you just rip it open? <laughs> There's no like... Okay, here we go. Opening the box. I feel like I'm just ripping it. Doo, doo, doo. I don't have any um any Funko Pop anything. I've always I there's several that I'd like to have, like the toothless one, but uh, I just don't have any. So this will officially be my first Funko Pop figure. Whatever it is. Yeah! I got Captain Mal. Jane would have been fun too, but Captain Mal is my favorite, so... Yes! I am super excited about this. You have no idea. I'm excited. I am so excited. Uh, this is like, the funny thing was I was really hoping I would get Captain Mal because he's my favorite. <laughs> so that's perfect. That is so perfect. You can go up here next to Toothless. This crow is only here because it's fall. So when the crow's gone, Captain Mal will have some more space. Okay, yeah, before I show you the last thing, this box is awesome. I might have to turn it into a shelf like I've seen some people do with their loot crate boxes, but it's the, you can see uh, R2-D2 right here. <laughs> it's definitely the, the uh, deck on the Serenity, but for some reason R2-D2's in there, so that's kind of fun. The interesting, the, the illustration in these always reminds me of, um, there's like this children's book that I read when I was younger. I can't remember what it's called. I can't remember anything about it. But the illustration was like this. Like tricolor type type illustration. That's really fun. I like it. Oh, fun. Oh, oh. This is sad that I just noticed this. So it comes down. And it's on the ground. So that's like the, the back of the serenity. Okay, that's awesome. Okay, last thing, you gotta take it out of its little package because it's just, you gotta have the full effect. Ah! Okay. <laughs> it's a tribble! It's a tribble! It's a fluffy, fluffy tribble. I was th actually thinking about making these for my Etsy shop. Making little tribbles. Because they'd be super easy to make, and they're super cute, and squishy and fluffy. The Loot Crate Star Trek Tribble. But yeah, if I if I made tribbles in my Etsy shop, would people buy them? Because they're just so easy to make, so I could sell them for super cheap. And they're so cute. Not super cheap, because the fur is kind of expensive, but fairly cheap. Oh no, I lost the button! No, not the button! Not my loot crate button. So this is the uh, I can't even tell if I'm focused on myself. This is the haul for me, my first and possibly only loot crate. We'll see if there's any other themes that I I can't resist. <laughs> I think the thing I'm most excited about it's divided between the Tribble and Captain Mal. I can't decide which one. They're just best friends forever. Although the money is pretty awesome too. I'm gonna have to find a way to display this. Cause it's cool outside of the, whatever you call these, but it's cool inside it too. I don't know. 100. Oh wait, I keep forgetting it's not focused up there. I am so sorry. You sure are talkative. I put videos on her channel a lot, so if you like, you know, videos of cute little cockatiels. Touch your mouth. Wait, wait. Come here. She just hissed at me. Well, she hissed at Captain Mal. Come here. Come say hi to Captain Mal. Yeah. 
She's nodding. Sweet! Toe trail! This is probably super entertaining because you can't see her, so you're just seeing me reacting with her. Toe trail, come here! Sweet, sweet, come here! Come here! She just did him again. Say hello to Captain Mal. Uh oh, he's got a thunder stick. It's just a toy. Come on. Oh, come here. Oh, she loves to land up there. Maybe she'll kiss the triple. Anyway, <laughs> so that's this month's loot crate. I just got it today. I'll probably end up editing and uploading this video today because if I don't do it now, I'll lose the courage because I did not make myself look good for this. And I'm, you know. Yeah. <laughs> Come give the triple a kissy. And yes, I am still in my PJs. Thank you for asking. Kiss kiss? Oh, do you want to preen the triple? He's preening the triple. Oh my gosh. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna bring them close to the camera. Wanna preen the triple? She's like, what? That is so cute. Oh. <laughs> hey, be gentle. Yeah, I felt you pull on that. <laughs> That's sweet. That was sweet. Yeah. You like the triple too, but you don't like Captain Mal because he has a scary thunder stick. Nope. Totoro's first loot crate too. I wish they had like a bark box type thing for, for cockatiels, huh? Cause you go through your toys like a car with horrible gas mileage goes through gas. Well, the triple's a success with Totoro. That's good. Yeah, oh. If you get a piece of fake fur in your face. Yeah. Anyway. Yay, Loot Crate. That was fun. I still think I'm out of focus. <laughs> that was fun. Totoro likes the triple. I love the triple too, but I really love the Captain Mal vinyl pop figure. Um, and the money. Oh my goodness. I have not had Pop Rocks since I was really young. So, I think to finish out this video... We're going to put some Pop Rocks in my mouth, and we'll see how I react. There's Sour Apple, too. Or Green Apple, but that's Sour Apple. What are you doing? Nope, you don't get to try these. That would be really bad for your pretty tummy. Yep. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I always hated it because it like hurt my teeth. I'm just going to put a very little bit in. <laughs> oh, it's weird. Can you hear it? Oh, it was weird. <laughs> it's not as bad as I remember being, but... It's still weird. Ugh. Now I just wanted to stop. <laughs> oh, Totoro doesn't like it either. Is my mouth making funny noises? Anyway, I hope you enjoyed my Loot Crate video. Yes! It's probably pretty boring compared to other Loot Crate videos, but I mean really hard to make them really exciting without taking so much time to do it that you've already seen everyone else's Loot Crate video and it doesn't matter anymore. I already know what's in it. Huh. Yeah. See? She agrees. Say bye. Say bye bye. I'm going to turn off the camera now. Come here. Say bye bye. Say I'm a nerdy birdie. Because I like Star Trek and triples. I'm a nerdy birdie. Woo! Nerdy birdie. 
<laughs> bye bye